You should have stayed away from my neighborhood!
is done in Harlem thanks to us. And don't say no. Miles, thanks to you. <laughs> okay, you're right. We did it together. How's it feel to be Harlem's friendly neighborhood Spider-Man? Not gonna lie, pretty good. Oh, almost forgot to tell you. Danica Hart heard what we've been up to. She wants me to come on her show. Oh, that's awesome. You nervous? What? Nervous? No. I mean, oh crap, what should I wear? I don't think it matters. Since it's a podcast... Wait, 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 what if she can hear that I'm wearing sweatpants? What if she wants to hop on webcam? Oh my god, I, I, I gotta get ready. Uh, bye. All right. Time to call Finn. Hope she answers. The guy can't find his car. Maybe it was stolen. Next train is arriving. getting caught. Jeez. Got this on a field trip to a Wakanda Design Group Expo. Finn saw all the tech on display and shouted, I want to be an engineer. <sighs> Guess it's stuck. Compliments the other. <laughs> one. Your dad and I fell asleep listening to this sound every night when we were kids. It's got a good beat. Okay. Something rhythmic that was around when dad and uncle Aaron were little. <sighs> nah. Oh. Getting too far away. Yeah, that's it. You probably don't know this. But your dad and I grew up not far from here, before we moved to Brooklyn in high school. Hearing the clatter of the wheels, the squealing when the trains turn or stop. Always makes me think of me and your dad's late night talks. Mostly about what we wanted to be when we grew up. I wanted to be a space engineer. Dad's dream changed. Doctor, firefighter, social worker. But he always wanted to help me. Yeah, sounds like dad. All right, time to call Finn. Hope she answers. Hi, Spider-Man. Finn, hey. Hey, man, your car's missing? Yeah, just finished a double shift. Came out to grab my car, but it's gone. I'm back on in 12 hours, and all I want to do is get home and sleep. I can make that happen. You have your key fob on you? The beep boop unlock thing. Yeah, got it right here. Awesome. One lost car, soon to be found. Okay. I can track the signal from the key fob to find the car. Stealing a medical tech's car in the dead of winter? That's cold, man. Literally and figuratively. Yeah.
I think I can find a better use for this. Chop shop. The car is definitely here. Guys, you stole an EMT's car after he worked a double shift? That is beyond uncool. Told you guys you should have used that line in Jersey. But oh. <laughs> We're all entitled to make a few mistakes. Don't you think I feel bad enough already? Oh boy, brother, trust me. I'm signing with him, bro. I need a slug of one. This is gonna hurt! Thieves them. And now I can use the fog to find the car. Just gotta follow the noise. Hey there. I found your car. Texting you the location. Incredible. Hey, cops finally showed up here. I'll see if they'll drive me to you. Thanks again, Spider-Man. Gonna tell everyone to use your app. After I get some sleep. Glad I could help. My work here Time is to often. Hope she answers. Hi, Spider-Man. Finn. Hey. We need to talk. In person. So you can lie to me again? So I can make this right. Please. Meet me at Trinity Church. No more lies. I promise. If you're screwing with me... Fine. I'll see you there. At least she's willing to meet. Okay, Trinity Church, let's go. Guys! Love the Spider Man! You're sick! Take this!
our debates and... That's your intro? <laughs> Lame! We in the business call that burying the lead. Burn up! Let me ask you something, Danny. Do you ever think about what you're inciting? About your journalistic integrity? More than some. Because your campaign against Roxanne is baffling to an actual journalist like myself. You should be attacking the young, unproved vigilante who keeps causing problems in Harlem. What? You, you twist everything Spider-Man does into something malicious while simultaneously excusing everything Roxanne does wrong. All Spider-Man needs for you to support him is to get a better PR department. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. The only problem Spider-Man fixes are the ones he causes. I won't praise the arsonist for putting out his fire. Meanwhile, Roxxon built a beautiful plaza in a failing neighborhood. By tearing down homes and businesses, our new Spider-Man is proving that Harlem isn't the failure Roxxon makes it out to be. And you, Mr. Jameson, for someone who... Mom made this cheesecake hot sauce for Finn's birthday. Abuelo's recipe, I think. Finn put it on everything. Always said, if it doesn't hurt, you're not doing it right. Serious about brand development? The sun comes was a hell of a way to tell me you're Spider-Man. What if I'd killed you? Do you want me to feel bad because you almost killed me? I want you to stop lying to me. I let you in the underground because I thought you understood. I do understand. What Krieger did to Rick, Roxxon needs to pay. Not like this. This is the only way I can beat him. I need you to look the other way. Please. I can't. I made a promise. So did I. Why'd you pick here? My dad brought us. To that concert. Seven choirs from seven countries. Remember? Ghana was my favorite. Ghana wasn't there. You're thinking of Guinea. No, no, I'm pretty sure it was Ghana. Guinea, Belize, Poland, Cuba. South Korea, Thailand, Venezuela. You're right. I usually am. Usually. Ah! <laughs> 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 